some other places here. I can walk around here. I have to wonder what is really going on. I feel some very different things as I walk through this cemetery. I will not talk about names. I will talk about feelings that I'm feeling go to many of these is to get a real touch of reality in here the name is on top I will not however go into it but I will fill it somebody has been in here before it's not somewhere I want to get into but I will fill this one I'm gonna fill it right now but this is truly another sad trip Somebody died of some kind of lung ailment. I'm finding it very hard to breathe. I, I don't know exactly. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it was like lung cancer, emphysema. Not a smoker. Something that... A horrible death. Very horrible death. And I feel my heart is really open for this person. The male figure. Another one put in a room away from the rest of the family in a very large house. Died in 1896, 97. And uh, just uh, just terrible. And then there's other family members and there. One woman in there, uh, 18 year old or 19 year old, died at childbirth. At childbirth, child didn't make it either. Let's see what I got going on over here now. Here's another one over here. I want to get some. I want to fill something here. It's a uh, it's fall coming, and uh, you can see in here. You can see exactly what's going on in here. Uh, you can see the graves. You can see all kinds of different things in here, and you can see what it looks like. There's a beautiful stained glass window on the back door is locked you can't get in here it is very old very old and, oh I'm feeling this through here one was a gentleman of old age very old age and he died a horrible horrible death another person alone famous people rich people rich in their own right financially and so on that have this crypt here and they are just super people they were actually very nice people but there was a lot of death in there a lot of destruction a lot of bad things that happened to them uh, I feel one male in here middle-aged male around 1924 25 who committed suicide out of despair he, he had other elements besides that but uh, I feel suicide just a terrible feeling all the way around that this person felt and uh, he's pushing on me now another one who didn't go into light and I have to invoke by the blood of Jesus Christ but stay away from me I beg of you by the blood of Jesus Christ stay away from me after I invoked the, 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 and pleaded the blood, it left me alone. And as I walked around here, I could feel a very bad sense of dread. So as I walked away more, I was getting sicker and sicker to my stomach. And the funny thing that happened here, most of all, is after I finished walking through here, I got into the car with Debbie and tried to start it and it would just click. And this went on for about five or ten minutes. Now this car 
It's fairly new. So after saying a few prayers, the vehicle started. For the rest of my trip, I did not. I did not shut the vehicle off. So this is the end of Crypt Reading. But I must say, do not do this. Some of these spirits are very bad and they will hurt you. They will hurt you. So, this concludes part three. See you on the next one.